What's going on everyone? I just seen a request on Reddit on how to pack up the fall line roller for your skis. So this is how you pack up the Dan Lackey fall line roller. The key things to remember is to get a ski bag slightly longer than your skis for some compression. Now another thing you have to worry about is your ski brakes. You don't want them pushing into the bottom of your roller while it's banging around inside the plane. You know it's going to get smashed around. I recommend taking some shoelace and tying two little loops like this and then you can tie them around your brakes and shop them up to the back of your binding just like this. That'll hold it fine, I use this at home all the time. It's perfect, it's cheap. Next I cover over the skis with some towels that I use to dry them off. I use my snow pants to cover over the tip of my skis and then I roll up the top of my snow pants into the top of the fall line roller bag so that if any top hit compressions happen, it will protect my skis, just like so. Fall line roller also comes boot bag. I prefer to use this bag when I'm underweight because it holds in my skis pretty well. It sits at the back behind your bindings and keeps everything in place quite easily and uh, puts the weight at the bottom of the bag. Next, I put my poles in the middle of the bag, and that holds some structural rigidity, and it kind of acts like a spine for the skis. All of my gear goes into the backpack I use where I ski, and then I put all of my goggles inside my helmet for protection. The helmet sits right in front of my bindings, right below my gear bag. Next, I take all of my clothes, and I roll them up, and I stick them inside bags that buffer between my helmet and my boots and all of my gear. This is also a top cushion for everything. Once it's all zipped up, I still use an external combination straw and I have about five different identifying tags inside the luggage. And that's about it to pack up the Dan Lucky Fall Line Roller.